Diaspora, a solo exhibition by Sara Sharma in Dubai at Art Sauer Gallery in DIFC in November 2014. Sharma's background makes her the perfect commentator for the troubled times in which she does her work, and she is now based in the Lebanon, having been displaced by the war from her native Damascus. Uh, I call the exhibition Diaspora, mm -hmm. because uh, as you see it consists of 12 paintings. Half of them were the last painting that were created in Syria, and the other half is the first painting that uh, created in Lebanon, mm -hmm. where I moved with my two children to live there because of the situation in my country. Mm -hmm. So together, they represent uh, the starting of my diaspora. Mm -hmm. <laughs> The paintings on show at Diaspora possess a special resonance and are perhaps some of the most powerful works she has created in the course of an already distinguished career. The style of the canvases show a masterly and bold approach to painting which is almost three-dimensional with swirls and distorted passages adding an often nightmarish quality to otherwise realistic portraits of subjects including her children. One is immediately struck by an underlying and powerful sense of anxiety which pervades Sharma's work and which is particularly pervasive when the paintings are viewed as a group. It's hard to be outside your country but uh, it's better, mm -hmm. it's better, so you forget this hardness because you have to live, you have to survive and this diaspora, we have to defeat it mm -hmm. because it will be before it will defeat us <laughs> like all the Syrian ones, they want to go back to their country, they want peace, they want, uh, they want the, the, the country that they used to know what I expect, every country after the war there is a lot of distortion, mm -hmm. uh, human distortion yeah, the buildings it will, it will yeah. be built again, mm -hmm. but the human distortion, uh, this is very uh, different. So I think the country will be totally different than it was before. Mm -hmm. some, some, most of the Syrian uh, are living this diaspora and uh, hoping to go back. Having all this yeah. dream is to go back to, to their homeland. But uh, you never know if they could go back, maybe they could they, Do they face another mm -hmm. diaspora? We never know. I'm not only talking about Syrian diaspora here. Every people or every population has lived diaspora. So I'm thinking about uh, anyone who lives this condition. I hope that people in diaspora try to find or explore something good from this situation. Uh, try to, to learn from the country that they found themselves in. Mm -hmm. uh, new experiences, new skills to use it in rebuilding their country uh, when they will come back, if they come back. The noted art historian Edward Lucy Smith, who wrote the introduction of the exhibition's catalogue and conducted a talk with Sharma, describes her approach thus. In essence, Shama's paintings take us on a journey of displacement in an almost cinematic sense, conjuring up the films of surrealist artists such as Dali and Brunel as they do so.